Hey everyone, welcome back to a brand new video for Warframe, and uh, we are cruising through this. And uh, how many, how much, how many, many days have been, have it been since I'm doing this? I, mean, I think it's approximately a month or more than that. Yeah, it, it's, I think it's about to be two months, and uh, soon, I mean, I might end this and uh, start Borderlands Three. And yeah, if anybody is new, I mean, which a lot of you are, just subscribe the damn channel. <laughs> I mean, uh, I need that dude or dudes, girls, whatever. But yeah, it helps a lot. Okay, today I am trying to massacre this frost by doing some experiments with Rhino and uh, with some other warframes, mostly Rhino. And uh, the thing is, a rhino is not that much leveled up, so yeah, it going to it's going to get messy. I mean, we don't have that much of a health and good weapons. But hey, let's see what we can do. Okay, here goes. Oh, our new ability unlocked. I mean that's stomp I think it increases your the damage you do yours and your teammates and um, I think Rhino has a passive skill when he lands lands down he just simply creates a shock wave that kills or kills his enemies or maybe stumble them stun them okay he's just I mean he just he hits a he hits us two or three times and we are done okay i'm just leaving the junction and uh i'm gonna switch to volt since he has a lot of a lot of hp that as compared to rhino i mean when i will level up my rhino and my other warframes they're gonna be unstoppable i mean rhino probably is going to be and with helmet they are just beasts okay there's a vault with the, I'm gonna select hack since it's better and furious and heat so I mean I maxed out so uh, it'll be very helpful in this one and the hack the reason and I, I'm selecting vault I told you before it's mainly because of its um, um, max rank and uh, it's very much power plus it has a it has a shield which we can uh, move around by I mean like man using maneuverability however we, however we want I'm sorry I didn't um, post any videos regarding uh, regarding the rest of the objectives re uh, of unlocking this junction Neptune junction and uh, hopefully we'll get this this time Indeed, you are a warrior. And um, today, I'm also using some presets uh, for videos um, from which film. Let's see how good they do. So this vault, uh, it seems he is a. Okay, he just. Oh, that was cold. That was cold. He beat us in the, just one or two like like moves, and we are done for. Okay, I'll approach him with a bit of caution here. Let's see. Okay, I think that didn't reach to him. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, damn it. It's cold. I mean, cold makes you slow. And, uh, oh, damn it. Okay, I'm dead. Just run. I need to run. I need to run. Okay, a vault has a speed effect. So even if he like, there we go. Even if he like slows me down a bit, be, I might be a bit faster than before. Okay, need to run. Need to run. Just don't die. Oh man. Oh man. Um, my health is. Very low. Okay, okay, okay. 
stop please okay stop stop man this specter is this specter is uh, taking me down oh my god i will f you up dude okay i'm dead Okay, next time I'll try the shield. Um, this time I'll try a shield. Let's see what it will do to us. And pick it up. And use speed. I mean, we do have. And here we go. Okay, we're slow down. Let's get going. Damn it. I was so close now. Damn it. I was so close. Oh, you're gonna die this time, dude. Okay, I'll use the gun this time. I mean, getting close to him is a bit of a... Uh, um, it puts me in a pinch. And doing this, doing this stuff is quite fun, if you ask me. And um, if anybody of you has a decent PC with a good CPU, like a Core i5 6th generation, 7th generation, or even an 8th generation, I mean, if it's 6 or above, you can play this game no problem with 16 GB or 8 gigs or 12 gigs of RAM easily without any issues. DDR4 RAM, it must be. And uh, yeah, that's it. I mean, you should play this game. It's it's good. Die, please die. Okay, I'm out. I'm out. I have a bit of life. Uh, I mean, oh, he died. How did he die, though? Oh, my sword effect. Yes, the heat sword causes. I mean, it afflicts fire upon you. Okay, I guess. And here we have the Neptune Junction, so we can just freaking go to Neptune now. And our second dream quest is unlocked. And if anybody anybody is uh, regular, you might be shocked to know that what what we are and uh, where we are. Okay, what happened? Okay, that that was weird a bit. A new quest is available in your codex. Hello, Lotus. It's the second dream. Okay. Um. So we got the chroma chassis, gamma core. I'll build gamma core next. I mean, I haven't tried it, w not even once uh, since I started playing Warframe, um, a few months ago, and uh, man. To be honest, I wanted to play this game since 2017 uh, because my friends used to play this and I didn't have a PC good enough to play this at that time. Um, I had a Quote 2 laptop, I think it was not that good. I mean, I could play in that, but it was not that good. So here we have our Limbo and um, I'm going to do a bit of a capture mission and uh, I won't, I, won't, I mean like I won't show com it completely. Like I'm gonna die a lot, I know that, because uh, this guy is not, um, sorry, this guy is not of, like, fighting Warframe, not for that, it's basically a stealth Warframe, uh, and uh, he doesn't, I don't think he has much of an armor, but his abilities are pretty damn good, pretty damn good, and, uh, okay, I think our... I uh, mean public I mean I'm on public okay no issues I mean as long as I can play that doesn't affect me uh, some of you might um, ask why I just uh, farm so many of our friends at the same time at once and uh, started using them Mo uh, randomly 
whenever I go to mission. The thing is, uh, you need to increase your MR rank fast because uh, I'm very quite quite ahead in the in the in the um, storyline, and uh, I don't need to activate uh, sorry access some good weapons in order to do some pretty damage. Oh damn it! Should have brought Rhino. Damn you. Man, our limbo is way too sensitive for this type of mission. Um, we cannot target. Oh, damn. Okay, here we are. And um, I just skipped it a bit. And we have our. We have our prisoner here. And we have captured him. And we need to. Oh, okay. That was the first for me. I used limbo before and used that ability. And. Uh, yeah, also sorry for the weird, weird, weird cut. Uh, it was because uh, it was taking too long. I was dying a lot, and uh, I didn't want to show you guys that. I, mean, I want to see somebody die in Warframe. Okay, nanospores. Get them while you can. Okay, here we go. Man, this is taking a lot of time. Usually extraction takes but less time. If we had Wukong, oh we need to get it. If we had Wukong, um, Wukong is the ultimate stealth power frame. I think, in my opinion, that is not what you have to follow. But I think and a lot of other players think about that. Since he can get to the like uh, those places where no warframe can get easily. Uh, without detection and uh, it's super fun I mean it, it has its limitations but uh, Wukong is a very adaptable Warframe it has pretty unique skills okay so our capture mission is done and uh, now we begin our second dream quest and heads up I think in this quest we might unlock the moon known as Lua. I guess. Maybe. Is it Lua or is it Moon? Okay, let's find out. Let me just start the quest. Okay. Um, let me just. Uh, here we go. Excellent armaments, operator. Please I know what is covered in blood. How dare you, Otis? Okay. Here we have our second dream, our sweet, sweet second dream. So, this guy's a stalker, and uh, those are, I think, sentient drones, maybe. 